The Oregon Steam Navigation Company OSN was an American company incorporated in 1860 in Washington with partners J. S. Ruckel, Henry Olmsted, and J. O. Van Bergen. It was incorporated in Washington because of a lack of corporate laws in Oregon, though it paid Oregon taxes. The company operated steamships between San Francisco and ports along the Columbia River at Astoria, Portland, and the Dallas, serving the lumber and salmon fishing industries. A railroad was built to serve the steamship industry. Topic: <laughs> Formation of the monopoly. The company was incorporated on December 29, 1860, at Vancouver, Washington, with 22 shareholders. Principal shareholders included D. F. Bradford, one of the owners of the North Bank Portage Railway at the Cascades, Jacob Cam, Harrison Olmsted, Simeon G. Reed, R. R. Thompson, and steamboat captains John C. Ainsworth and L. W. Coe. The company then gained control over most of the boats on the Columbia and Snake Rivers. Timon described the Oregon Steam Navigation Company as the many-tentacled monopoly of river transportation. From 1858 to 1863, the Oregon Portage Railroad operated 4.5 miles of track between Bonneville and Cascade. The railroad hauled primarily military and immigrant traffic. In 1862, the railroad was sold to the Oregon Railway and Navigation Company for $155,000. Soon afterwards, the company acquired most of the steamboats on the Columbia and Snake Rivers. The Oregon Railway and Navigation Company purchased the Oregon Steam Navigation Company in 1879. On the Lower Columbia, the company's boats included Senorita, Fashion X James P. Flint, Julia Barclay, Bell of Oregon City, Mountain Buck, and Carrie Ladd. On the Middle Columbia, boats were Mary, Hasselow, Wasco, and Idaho. On the Upper Columbia, the company ran the Tenino and the Colonel Wright. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Competitors bought off. In 1862, river transport concerns not involved with the Oregon Steam Navigation Company formed the People's Transportation Company. The new competitor put the E.D. Baker on the Lower Columbia, the Iris on the Middle, and the Kios on the Upper Cascades. These boats posed serious competition to the monopoly, so much so that in about 1864, the Oregon Steam Navigation Company paid its rival $10,000 a year to confine its operations to the Willamette River. Oregon Steam Navigation Company also picked up People's Transportation's boats Iris and Kios, in exchange for three OSN boats on the Willamette River, Onward, Rival, and Surprise. <laughs> <laughs> Expansion of fleet Traffic increased in the early 1860s, so in 1863 and 1864, OSN added the Nez Perce Chief, the Webfoot, the Owyhee and the Yakima, all built at Sealilo on the Upper Columbia, and the Mississippi-style sidewheeler Oneonta on the Middle River. OSN also purchased the sidewheeler New World to work the Lower Columbia. By 1878, OSN had added to its fleet the sternwheelers Harvest Queen, John Gates, Spokane, Annie Faxon, Mountain Queen, R.R. Thompson, and Wide West. Topic: <inaudible> Struggle for the portages Control of the portages was critical to control of the river. OSN controlled all the portages, including both the North and the South Portage Railways around the Cascades which had once been in competition with each other as well as a portage system that had been built around Sealilo Falls by one Orlando Humason. In 1863, the company replaced the mule-drawn portage railway on the north side of the Cascades with a steam locomotive. The company also built a 13-mile steam railway from the Dallas around Sealilo Falls, which opened on April 23, 1863 and cost $1 million to build. Cascade Portage and Railroad, Washington side, 1867 Oregon. Pony. First steam engine in Oregon, used on Portage Railroad. Topic. Competition. The People's Transportation Company was organized in 1862 to compete with the Oregon Steam Navigation Company. 
The company then began a rate war with the OSN People's Transportation was so successful that OSN bought them off with an agreement to pay them $10,000 a year for 10 years if People's Transportation would restrict its operations to the Willamette River. Topic. See also Steamboats of the Columbia River List of steamboats on Columbia River John Gates Portland Mayor OSN's chief engineer starting in the 1860s